In November 2012, Bonham sold the large size version of the Dolly Sisters by Shiparis for a hammer price of £230,000. In June 2013, Bonham sold the large version of the study Al Maria for £220,000. Now Bonham's takes great pleasure in presenting the finale. Romanian by birth, Shiparis established his workshop in the decadent atmosphere of Paris in the 1920s, the Jazz Age. This was a city where new avant-garde styles were being established, such as Cubism and the outrageous and flamboyant new style, Art Deco. Shiparis quickly established a relationship with foundries who could cast bronze for him and also with skilled carvers of ivory. Each study would be meticulously carved by hand and assembled to his instruction. These craftsmen would help to bring to life his masters of dance and his art deco ladies. Finale represents Shiparis's fascination with the Ballet Russe and its impresario Sergei Diaghilev. Diaghilev took 1920s Paris by storm with his energy and imagination. His shows weaved together traditional elements of Russian folklore combined with electrifying dance and spectacle that paid tribute to the affluent age of jazz. Many of the costumes that were created were the work of another great visionary, Leon Bast. The central figure depicted in the finale is thought to be lead dancer Vaslav Nijinsky. The Nijinsky figure wears a skin-tight costume that is adorned with jewels and gilded highlights. The dramatic flame-red costume evokes dramatic spectacle, which was the essence of a ballet russe performance. Diaghilev wanted his audience to imagine the future and Shiparis manages to capture here that futuristic vision and bring it to life. An important Shiparis group such as this manages with great precision and intricate craftsmanship to hold a moment in time. The finale has all the elements of a triumphant curtain call, with an invisible audience seemingly clamouring for more. Mm -hmm.